mentioned um, working for the man, and you mentioned the challenges that people have, you know, uh, especially in our economic situation, working for other people, small business ownership, mm -hmm. sales careers, blue collar, all these incredible challenges that are in that uh, those right. arenas. Right. Uh, our, our economic situation is worldwide. It's it's uh, certainly changed. Um, the rules have changed. What do you see as far as um, what's going to happen this era of network marketing in this economy? What do you see as, as uh, what's going to happen? What's the big opportunities? You know, what are people going to be looking at? Those well, you know, the, the economy is changing. And today, the world economy is a lot more integrated than it was 20 years ago mm -hmm. when I started this industry. There was a day when you could get commissions out of different countries, and if one country had a recession, it didn't affect the other countries. And it was this really nice, diversified right. income stream, right? right? Well, today, it's all interrelated. So everybody's getting hit today, and we're in an unprecedented time. And nobody wants to say the D word, but we're basically in a depression, okay? It's mm -hmm. ugly, and mm -hmm. it's going to get a little bit worse, you know, through 2009 before it starts to get any better. And we're going to see thousands of banks fail this year sure. in this country and, and around the world. Europe is probably in a worse situation than we're in right now. Yeah. So it's really tough, and that, that just creates a tremendous pool of people that two years ago wouldn't even listen to us. Two years ago, they could put a house under contract and make 20 grand before they even closed on it. Why, why work? Right. You know, it, it was fluff. It was fantasy. It wasn't reality. Yeah. So today, there's really hard realities facing people. And the good thing about that is that we have some real solutions for people. So that's, that's the good news. Yeah. Okay. Now, you know, today, people are not looking for investment. Right. Opportunities because they don't have any money to invest. Right. They're looking for income Cash opportunities, money. and that's what this industry provides people. We we give people an immediate ability to create income, and that's what people are looking for. So, in times like this, we do really well. Are, I mean, really. Do, well. do, do you see us? <clears throat> I think we need to be able to tell our tell. The, we have an opportunity to tell the story, um, and I think we need to do a better job of somehow saying to the world. Look, the scariest place to be in the entire world, the most insecure place to be in the entire world, is working for a company. Right. Today, I'll yeah. tell you. I'll tell you the two reasons that network marketing is the best business vehicle on Please. the planet. Okay. And these are not really discussed openly yeah. in our industry. Oh, well, great. But this this is after you know my my small brain thinking about this for twenty years. <laughs> right. Okay. I mean, Forty million really, dollars worth of results. All right. These are these are two things that make a lot of sense. And you know, if there's anybody who's, you know, a corporate chieftain who's listening to you know this interview at some point, or a business owner, you're gonna understand this. You're gonna hear this right now and understand it. Okay. So, number one reason is that this industry is completely efficient. Mm. That's why people like me can make a lot of money. Okay. Because I've been here 20 years. You know, doing it every day. I don't really take a whole bunch of breaks. I'm just consistent because I love the business, because I love people, because I want to help them be successful like I've been. Right. Okay? So here's, here's the number one thing. If you're a slug and you work in a big company and you're kind of hiding in there and you're hoping nobody finds out about you because you're a slug and you, know, you don't even really produce anything, you actually distract people that are trying to do their job. Right. You're kind of a disruptive person. Huge corporations are full of these kind of people. They're hiding out in these companies, and right now they're trying to find them and get rid of them. Right. Because those people are dead weight. And if you're a productive person, and you work in that same big company, you're hauling that unproductive person on your back. Mm. You're trying to produce enough for you and to pay their salary. Mm. Okay? And big companies, by their very nature of the traditional employer-employee structure of the world that's been out there for 100 years, that model is becoming more and more broken because it carries... It has to carry mm. lots of unproductive people. Now, if you can, you know, have an un inefficient system like that, and you could change it, mm. and you could make it completely efficient. And in, in this business of network marketing, the reason it's efficient is I don't get paid anything unless I produce. Right. Period. Right. It's completely efficient. I don't have to haul anybody on my back. And so, if you're a productive person and you're working in one of those big companies, and you finally recognize all this, and you recognize how many people that really don't produce anything in those companies, they just sit there and 
push paper or you know go to meetings or push memos and take a salary home and the company has to pay their benefits and their overhead and their insurance and everything else and you realize that you're paying for all that with your productivity mm -hmm. that's a nightmare that drives you crazy so what happens it's like insurance pools you know health insurance pools your health insurance goes up and up and up because over time the healthy people exit and the pool just gets stuck with all the sick people mm. and that's kind of the way big companies are is that you know, smart people that go, I don't want to carry everybody. They start looking for opportunities that are more efficient, yep. where they can get paid more what they're going to produce. Okay. They're not afraid of being paid for production. Right. They want to be paid for production. They're confident people. They leave all the slugs and the non producers in those companies. Mm -hmm. And they get worse and worse and worse as time goes on because good people go, there's mm -hmm. better ways. I'm out of here. I'm exiting. Okay. And so that's why it's becoming more and more broken as time goes on. And more and more productive people are going to find their way to places where they can be more closely compensated with what they know they're producing. Okay, well, if you if you want to be completely compensated, totally tied to what you produce, network marketing is your vehicle. There's nothing that's more efficient in the economy, and that's why you can make so much money. Right. Okay, so, so that's a really important point is, you know, why people need to think about that, okay? And it ties to the second point, and that is there's so few things out there. There's really no other business vehicles where I can give you the same exact opportunity I have. Hmm. So if you think about a small business, you can't do it. There's the owners and there's the employees. And the employees will never be motivated like the owners are. No, never. The owners are the first ones there. They're the last ones to leave. They turn off the lights when nobody else does. They pay everybody else, and if there's anybody left, they pay themselves. Right. And they can't make everybody the owner. Right. Okay, there's just not enough to go around to do that. And that's the flaw, okay? Mm -hmm. In this industry, everybody's an owner. Everybody owns their own distribution business, so to speak. So everybody can have the same opportunity. I've got numerous people that are underneath me in my downline, in my network, yep. that make more money than me. Yep, me too. Okay, and that's, you know, that's the ultimate proof. Yep. It's not a pyramid scheme. In a pyramid scheme, the top guy's gonna make the most money no matter what, you know? What you really have with real network marketing is just a production cube, you know? And if somebody wants to build a bigger production cube of volume than my cube, they're gonna make more money than me. It doesn't matter if they're underneath me, above me, whatever it is. You got okay? their own business, right? That's right. So I can give every person the exact same opportunity, and that's really, really rare, mm. that you can empower somebody to have exactly what you have. Right. It's really pure. It's fascinating. Very good. 